Hello, I am Patricia McNeely. I am an illumined Blu-ray Twin Flame from Chicago, Illinois. And today in this video, I'm going to talk to you about my most recent webinar that I've come out with. And there, once again, I've packed a lot of really great material into it. A lot of people have had questions and the holidays left people with a lot of questions, scratching their head, wondering why things are the way they are or why things haven't shifted. It's up to you to pull your union and really get comfortable with some things. This does include elevating and descending back in and yes, I'm calling this one Surrendering into Union. It is my brand new webinar for January. There are several pertinent subjects for people. And some of you may have found that, you know, you're not sure what the holidays were going to bring, what you were hoping it would bring. And some things are a little bit different. You may have found that other people's energies affect your union or affect you and your twin flame. So the topics that I talk about in here, and with every single webinar that I have, I have tools. It's not just talk. Talk is getting us not very far. It takes actions. And some of the actions, some of you are not understanding exactly what it's taking here. Um, the reason that I'm presenting this, I want people to get past a lot of the mental and emotional hurts. The things that have come up between you and your twin, the very things that need healing. And how do you get beyond it? How do you really come together and really be who you came here to be? So I talk about getting deeper into your own cosmic sacred heart with your twin flame. And what does it mean? What is it? How do you do it? Some of you who have been buying my webinars, thank you very much. You've been building up to this point. I also talk about what surrender is and what surrender isn't. There's a lot of misconception about what is surrender. So I hope to round out the picture of that for you so that you can implement it and put it into action when you need to. What is it that you actually do need to surrender to and what are not appropriate things to surrender to? I talk about that in here. That's a biggie for people. Because people are not quite understanding this uh, from a higher perspective. And you're, this is a soul thing. This is going to be coming home to each other and being able to go back to where you've come from, essentially. So I talk about a lot of what it is and what it isn't so that it's clear to you. Releasing karmic relationships with people and places for good. Some of you found out during the holidays uh, that a lot of the people around you were still living in karma. There are people that are not going to let go of their karma easily, and yet you'll still be near them. What do you do about it? I talk about false twins of all kinds, mental, emotional, false twins, uh, sexual false twins, confusions, because people are still becoming confused. Even when things feel lightened up, it was a lot less confusing in the older energies. Pe pe people would feel it very negatively. Sometimes it's not very clear. It's getting more subtle as you go along here, and yet you still have to be able to let go of those false twins. The next subject that I talk about, this is a biggie. This is for those people, all of you who have been wondering, where's my money coming from? Doesn't spirit, don't the saints, the angels, the guides, don't they know that we're still living here and we still have to pay some bills, raise children, put clothing on ourselves, put food in our mouths, put a roof over our heads. It is duly noted that in every level of physical living, including this one, that yes, not only should you, you're expected to. And how do you get your abundant flow going? And I'll say this, the law of attraction when it comes to twin flames only goes so far. 
a lot of people start hitting that glass ceiling. Your abundant flow through the heart and the crown together and how to clear it. How do you get your crown opened? And some people might say, oh, I know how to do that. If you're not getting the energies down from above and into your heart, then maybe you don't know everything about it. You may not. And yet it is through that process that your abundant flow gets going. How to clear for your new life in union because, yes, you will be living with each other. You're expected to live with each other. You will live with each other. This is going to be a 2016 of many delightful surprises and reunions and coming together. Your life in union will be physical in every possible way. And it's already up here. How do you hold it down here? That's what I talk about. How to clear for your new life and still stay in union. Because neither one of the couple, neither person in your twin union is going to be able to do anything without the other. That's just how it is. It's that way on purpose. And your twin will be keep coming and coming and coming to you. And you will still need to be able to hold it, channel it through to the heart. I also have some very special information for other Blu-ray Twin Flames, especially those who are Rod and Staff, there is a special message in there about your sacred energies and what to do about it, what will be going on. So again, my webinars, which can be accessed through my website, and that is at www.twinflamesmerge.com. It will be available in the text below the video, and I always put it on my videos. If you don't see it, it is www.twinflamesmerge.com. Thank you again to everybody who bought my previous webinars. I know that I get a lot of great feedback on them, and I take what happens during the sessions and there's a lot of information that actually is condensed into a very concise format. It is informational, it's energetic, and it's especially elevating and uplifting. It's very much created so that people do get reconnected with your fun, with your adventure, with your true love. So please do expect that this year of 2016, especially if you've met your twin, this is the one. And your surrender is where your liberation is found. So, you know, there's going to be a lot of things that seem like paradoxes this year. My webinars bring it very much into concise human understanding. And it is right there for you to access 24-7. You can very much get this at any time, at any place. It doesn't require you to get on a plane. It doesn't require you to commit to a certain amount of time. Everything is in there for you to refer to and access again. Because sometimes my webinars are like one of those movies where you look at it again and you may glean much more information. That's You go at it at your own speed. But try it. If you haven't tried one of my webinars before, this one here for 2016 is very concise. The one that I did last year in January, which actually had so much material, I had to divide it into two pieces. That's really good for a lot of people coming into the cycle. And if you uh, do get it, please know that one of the companions to this will be the September one, September called Universally Free to Fly. If you have met your twin and you're expecting to be with them, expect to fly with them. That would be another important one to get. So thank you again to everyone who's already bought one. 
I do wish you well. This is going to be a wonderful year, and this is here to help you. Link is below. It's going to be on here at the end. Right at the bottom here. So thank you very much, and there's going to be more to come. Bye now.